Lesson number 24 is to have a good poker face. Now, what this means is that you don't want to show your opponent anything, especially when you get tired. Now, let's say, for example, you're deep in the rounds, you know, you're standing up, you're really tired. You don't want to be in front of your opponent or sparring partner and you want to be like breathing heavy, chopping your hands, walking away. You need to do the complete opposite. You need to show that even though you are tired, you're projecting a really focused, you know, still solid striker that they can see. So it's a really, really simple thing that can change everything about what's going on in the actual moment. So if your opponent can see that you're tired, they're going to push the pace. And alternatively, if they can see that you're actually you know, well composed, but even though you might not be, but you're giving off that effect that you're ready and you're absolutely on the ball to counter what they throw, then you're going to be in a much better position. So always keep a good poker face. Don't show that you're tired. Don't show that you're out of breath. Don't show that you've got a lack of energy. Completely transform yourself, even when you're tired, and keep it all composed and keep it all together. Usually when I'm sparring or yeah, mainly sparring, I'll look for my opponent to just show those signs of weakness and then I'll either increase the pace and increase the tempo just so I know I'm getting that extra edge on them and if they're not showing their poker face I know that you know they're deteriorating throughout the round so to say but always have a good poker face, never look like you're tired etc and uh, it will serve you really well.